of, of the many things that I'm impressed about you. Uh, you, had, man, you talk about people that don't look like what they've been through. Mm -hmm. My God, you don't look like what you've been through, man. At all. I'm telling and, you. and I know this week uh, we're uh, pleased to know that you have a product yeah, yeah. Uh, that, that has come out. Come on, tell everybody what, what's going on with the book release. Yeah, absolutely. And, you know, uh, I appreciate you and, of course, your brother. Y'all just too man, preaching, man. man. Preaching machines. Man, we are. We, we are. We do. 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 The garbies ain't nothing to play man, with. Man. Yeah, nobody else don't talk. We'll take the mic. <laughs> Absolutely. And you know, uh, just yesterday was the official release of MBK on MLK. And you say, well, what is MBK? My Brother's Keeper. Yes. Um, and really, Dr. King suggested uh, we'll either live together as brothers or perish together as fools. Yes, sir. And so there's a clarion call to really galvanize our communities, to uplift one another. Yes, sir. Uh, and it really speaks to our boys, our men, and the women who love them to repair, restore, and reconcile ourselves to each other, wow. our families, and our communities. Yes, sir. If we need that, it's now more than ever from the school system to the water system. That's right. We are really perplexed with the whole aspect of injustice. Yes. And we know if injustice anywhere is a threat to justice everywhere. Everywhere, yes, sir. As Dr. King suggested. Yes, sir. Now, Dr. Connor, I know yesterday was officially uh, MLK Day. Yeah. Uh, but I would be remiss um, because of, of the eloquence of everything that you've done, what you stand for. Uh, you don't stand for MLK Day just on one day out the no, year. No, uh, no. You, you, you embody uh, MLK Day 365. Uh, can, can, can we just have you give some reflections on what that day means? Uh, but living out his legacy, what his legacy means, our, 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 is the dream deferred? Uh, you know, we have uh, President Obama, obviously, uh, is the dream realized? Or, or just give us your perspective, Doc. Yeah, that's a great question. It's, it's a power pack question. You think about it, uh, of course, you got a black man in the White House. Yes, sir. But oftentimes, it's an illusion of inclusion. <laughs> Say that again. Sir, <laughs> yeah, it's an illusion of inclusion. Uh, We're we going to sneak a preach this morning. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to sneak a preach here. Yeah. They better watch listen, out. Listen, when we collect the offer, it's all going <laughs> it's to all you, Doc. Oh, man. <laughs> you know, I share, man. I'm blessed. You're blessed. <laughs> absolutely. Absolutely. Uh, freeze framing him in just August 28, 1963. Yes. Mm. He right, was right. more than just some utopian dreamer. He was more exactly. than just some docile dreamer. Yes. He was a doer. Absolutely. absolutely. He was a freedom fighter mm. for justice. He was more than just a one, one speech type of individual. Fighting for the, on his, on his, on his way even just into the, uh, before he was assassinated, fighting for the sanitation, sanitation work. Right, yeah. right, exactly. You know, and uh, the poor people's campaign yes. is what he was getting ready to galvanize and mobilize. He challenges capitalistic challenges, society. Absolutely, yes, challenges yes, capitalistic society. Absolutely, capitalistic society. We especially talked about the three, uh, the triple evils of society, poverty, uh, militarism, mm -hmm. and racism. Exactly. Mm -hmm. And um, for us to really understand that it's about being a servant. Yes, the greatest yes. leaders are the greatest servants. Absolutely. Yeah. And anybody can be great because everybody can serve. Oh, my God. And so when we have that heart of a servant, mm -hmm. is that is where it's not about me, it's not about ego, it's yes, not sir. about me getting to shine, mm -hmm. but it's about me uplifting somebody else's life right. to move to the next level. Yes, sir. It's really what we have to have. And, um, you know, it really leadership is not... A title is a function. Oh, oh, oh. Leadership is not a title, it's, it's a, a function. function. Yeah, yeah. It's you know what? Stop it. It's about, you, it. <laughs> it's about it? you pushing others. And real leadership is not about you creating followers. Right. Real leaders create leaders. Leaders, yes, sir. Yeah. Yes, sir. And yeah. so uh, when we have the aspect of, of individuals like yourselves who are here, not just to pump yourself, but to actually speak truth to power. Man, that's what it's and about. to use your platform yeah. and your voice to really mobilize a movement and uh, galvanize people to do something in their neighborhood. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You know, I'm, I'm from the east side of Detroit. Man, man. me I'm too, man. Yeah, yeah. East side. Yeah. <laughs> we yeah, we know how to roll all day. All day long. Go on Connor. Connor on Connor, man. Come on, when man. I look at, <laughs> Come on, man. When I look at the blight, when I look at the, the oh. deprivation, yeah. and I look at the dilapidation in the yes, community, sir. man, you have to ask yourself a question, as mm -hmm. Dr. King said, is there not a cause? Ooh, yeah. How long, not long, not long. Mm -hmm. can I live like this, yes, man? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And, uh, you know, when, when our children... A gentleman told me yesterday, we were at the palace mm. uh, for just a real quick minute. Right. And I, I saw my you brother. Saying, I'm like, I Reverend Eric came, came through. <laughs> came through. <laughs> I told him walk through. Right, right. Rock right. Walk through. Rock and watch him walk through. I told him he was there. That's Handsome and wealthy. Yeah. <laughs> No, he was there. Yeah. I saw him. I touched him. I handled him. But, uh, the cool little Wayne, he moving G like this. I'm moving silence. Like, 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 he got it all, man. Out, he, he, you got the G, guy. Come on, man. You know what come I'm on, saying? Come on, man. Um, what brother told me, he said, he said to me, really, a success for our students on a daily basis 
is getting to school. See? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Before that, we even it. bring the books into the conversation, Man. before yeah. while they while they're sitting there with rodents and rats and mushrooms Goodness. and wearing their coat because they can't even learn in a cold environment because you know they're they're faced with the, the perplexity of trying to get an right. education. And That's they don't cool. even have the basic amenities. Yeah. The, the the real success is them getting to school safely Absolutely. when they walking without street lights. Man. When they when they're facing a perplexing wow. you know aspect. And so uh, goodness, we we really have to look and ask ourselves what can we what do can we do to My contribute con, to contribute to the human condition. Yeah. My goodness, yeah. but you know Absolutely. what? That that this is why I love this man. I know that. <laughs> it's it's about to go down on Truth and Transparency Tuesday. This is Ralph Gabby. You're on nine ten a.m. This is the Superstation, the division of Adele Media, Detroit's largest voice for African Americans. Radio our way. We'll be right back. We're five. Awesome, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Awesome, man. Yeah, yeah. Awesome, man. Yeah. 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 Yeah.